Hello students, let us see this question here. In the circuit here, the steady state voltage across capacitor C is a fraction of battery EMF. The fraction is decided by. So in the steady state, the capacitor will be fully charged and no current will flow in this circuit, in this capacitor. So you can remove this entire part. This entire part can't be removed because at the steady state, removed at a steady state. Because a steady state, the capacitor will fully charge and no current will flow in this part of the circuit. So the current will flow only here. So let us assume this value is I here. So I can say the value of I will be equal to V upon R1 plus R2. So now if I want to find out the potential difference across this capacitor, so let us assume the potential difference across capacitor is C and since there is no current through R3, so there will be no potential drop across this resistor. So whatever potential drop across R2 is there, right, that will be the same potential drop across capacitor. So I can see potential drop across capacitor will be equal to potential drop across R2 because there is no current in R3 part, okay. So and so potential drop across R2 will be equal to I into R2. So the value of I it is given here. So V upon R1 plus R2 into R2. So I can see uh, the potential difference across capacitor will depend on the resistance R1 and R2. So which option is there? Let us see. R1 only this is wrong. R1 and R2 only this is correct. So option B is correct. Okay students, I hope you understood this question.